This video explains how to install Visual Studio Code and useful extensions. I am Shuichi Ozu of Digipub Japan. We are going to install Visual Studio Code and its extensions which are useful for Angular developers. We are going to install VS Code or Visual Studio Code. Start VS Code. Open command line in VS Code. Then add useful extensions of VS Code. At first, material icon themes extensions, which enables to differentiate similar files with colorful icons. Next, bracket pair colorizer extension, which enables to distinguish between nested brackets by color. Next, Angular TypeScript snippet extensions, which includes many useful templates in writing TypeScript and HTML. Finally, TypeScript Hero extension, which has the function of auto writing input statements. At first, we are going to install Visual Studio Code. Open its download page of VS Code. Its URL is code.visualstudio.com slash download. <coughs> Click download button according to your operating system. I'm going to select Windows button here. Then, download will start. After the download, open the download directory. Double click the setup file. Then, its installation will start. After the installation, next step is start VS Code. Open command prompt in a Windows. At first, make some directory for testing. Here I'm going to make test directory and enter into the directory. Then type code space dot to start VS code. It's very easy. Next step is open command line in VS Code. Type control plus add key. Then the terminal window will open in VS Code. You can open more windows by clicking plus icon. If you want to switch to the other terminal window, open the drop down list and select the target window. It's very easy. Next step is add material icon theme extension, which enables to differentiate similar files with colorful icons. Before its installation, what these similar files such as app component ts, app com component spec ts, and app component html. It's a little bit difficult to identify. So we're going to install this extension. Click the extensions icon in the left side. Type material in the search box. 
then material icon theme will be displayed. Click install button. Click reload button. After the installation, you will find tabs icon above. And you will find the similar files icon which you saw before. Next step is add bracket pair colorizer extension which enables to distinguish between nested brackets by color. Before the installation, check these nested brackets. As before, click extensions icon in the left side, type bracket in the search box. Then, bracket pair colorizer will be displayed. Click install button. Next, click reload button. After the installation, you will find that the outer bracket is yellow and inner bracket is red. It's very helpful for debugging. Next step is add Angular TypeScript snippets extensions, which includes many useful templates in writing TypeScript and HTML. Type Angular in the search box, then Angular B5 snippets by John Papa will be displayed. Select it. Then its info will be displayed. Try to click the name, then its usage will be displayed in your browser. Click install button. Next, click reload button. After the installation, make some dummy TypeScript file for test in the src slash app directory. <laughs> Open the file and type a hyphen component Select a hyphen component. Next, select a hyphen component hyphen root. Template will be inserted. Okay. <coughs> then clear all the lines. Next, Select a hyphen directive. Okay, then clear all the lines. Next, select a hyphen 
http client hyphen get okay then create the line next select a hyphen http hyphen interceptor okay it's very convenient final step is add typescript here extension which has the function of auto writing import statements before the installation Open app module TS file in BS code and try to input forms module in the import section. BS code will display the error underline because it needs important statement above. As if whole input TypeScript in the search box, then TypeScript Hero will be displayed. Click Install button. Next, create reload button. Again, open up module TS file and input home module. Check the top line. The import statement will be added automatically. It's very helpful. You are interested in more extensions. I recommend you view Mr. Hamedani's blog. If you want to know the extensions here in more details, please view each extensions page. Thank you for watching.